Before you ever see the welcome sign at Humphreys Garrison, you see something else, and it's quite the attention getter. It's a shotgun. You'll normally see gate guards with a smaller sidearm, but there's always a guard on duty with a shotgun, watching and waiting. Now, with a weapon that has such a kick, you have to wonder, do they know how to use it? This is the range where guards and U.S. soldiers train at least six times a year. They train on pistols and shotguns. But just because they aren't U.S. military doesn't mean they get a bit of slack. It's Sergeant First Class John Arnett's job to make sure his security is up to snuff as the installation security NCO. And being a former drill sergeant, who could be better suited for a no-nonsense job that's all about enforcing standards and cutting slack? you got to hold your weapon. It's not mine. The guards themselves have to be trained to United States Army standards that we hold the same, we hold soldiers accountable to. And so when you consider the fact that they have less training than those soldiers and they're performing to the same standards, it's really remarkable what they can accomplish. So they're doing well. The shotguns aren't exactly a new addition to the Humphreys arsenal. They've been there for a long time, but they're just now getting to see action at the gates. The reason we have uh, put the shotguns out there is not to any one particular threat but just to provide the soldiers and families of USAG Humphreys a safer and more secure environment to uh, protect them while they sleep. So next time you're rolling through the gate and see that shotgun, you can feel good that it's on your side. Airman Larry Moore from Humphreys Garrison, Korea.